Back in the 24-hour stream doing Lord of Root. Go ahead and see what this guy's all about. So, the only thing we have open is port 22. Is this one not working? I feel like we have more than just that open. But you never know. Maybe not. One three three seven is also open. Okay. Cool. So we got twenty two and one three three seven. Let's go ahead and M map tack P one three three seven on ten ten zero seven. See what that guy is like right there. Saying he's down. Saying that port doesn't actually exist. It 100% exists. Okay. I will do it. I'll take the ring into Mordor. Okay. Nothing else on there. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, do a, let's see here, gold buster for it. For 10-10-0-7. Port 1-3-3-7. And we'll go ahead and also do a Nikto scan on that one too. 10, 10, 0, 7, 1, 3, 3, 7. Somebody grab some popcorn soon. Okay, I think we have a slash images. That's it, huh? Hipster. I will do it. Let go of this. Now we have. Okay. Import 22. And that's it. Okay. have that much now do we uh, let's do that let's do the um, secular one the big one there See what this shows us. We got anything here? UDP. That's a good point. I map F. I map. Tac P tac. Well, tac SU for 10, 10, 0, 7. I think I have to run that with sudo, don't I? Oh, uh, is it tac S capital U for UDP? Yep. That's capital U. Yep, pseudo. Probably over attack VV, huh?
Nothing shown in UDP. So I think we really got is this last co-buster left, and we'll see what happens. Give me another steganography. We'll never know. Did I save it in here? I thought I saved them all in here. Where did I save them all at? Whoops. No comments in there, it doesn't look like. No comments. There. No comments in there. All right, so there's no comment on anything. Uh, what about that first? Yeah, we already got that one. This guy's still running over here, and we ran out of stuff to run. All right. Uh, we can always try to send Rocky.txt. That I've seen that once before, where Rocky.txt goes at something. So we can always try that, like right there. Um, try another rust scan on it. Twenty two one three seven. Keep saying that it's down. This probably isn't helping over here, but yeah, that's SSH. Twenty two one I mean, sure. <laughs> the only thing we got is 1337 and 22, like right now, and there's nothing in 13. Well, there's no. Well, I guess we can always look at vhost. But I don't know about vhost on this. Um, try port knocking. On what port? On 1337?
I got it. Yep. That's the stage gives you a banner. I should have actually checked that in all honesty because a lot of the Marine Corps, they put like a banner in there. And usually they put some stupid shit in there. I should have actually checked that. All right, I've not done knocking in a while. So... That's okay though, we can figure out how to pour knock again. That's not gonna be very difficult. But I've not done it in a long time. Use your local bin. But I'm pretty sure I have like a knocked out SH or something like that. I thought I had something other than knocked out pie. Okay, home Kelly knock. Okay. So we have to knock. So, okay, so let's go ahead and do a, we'll say M map. Let's go ahead and do Lord of Root, like right here. Whoopsie daisy. Lord of Root. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna knock. We're gonna say M map, show us this. Station in the box, you get a banner, right? Let's go ahead and look at that. Okay, so let's go ahead and knock now. Um, so we need to do the host, which is going to be 10 10 0 7, the port 1. I think it's just two, three like that. I think it's like that for this guy. All right, let's try to do another rust scan again. See if we open anything up. I think it's like that for that one. I don't think it's commas. I think it's like that. Wherever you do like um. Or is it comma two, comma three? Is it like that? No. Okay, cool. So yeah, it's like that. I'm not seeing any more ports open. Let's see if one three three seven changed though. No. One three three seven was already open though. We already had that. One three three seven. We we've been there. Yeah. I map a rust cam might have knocked it open. <laughs> Yeah, 137 was already there. So, in that case, we didn't get anywhere yet. Hey, thank you much for a follow, Theo56. Let's see here. Do we have like a robots now or anything like that? Do we open up like something within that port now? Because that's been open. 
And that should have been it, like right there. That's all we should have had to do for port knocking at least. I think, can we also knock with M-Map, just make sure? And then she gives you a hint as well. Oh, that, we looked at the exit data for it. There was nothing in it. We just have, I'll take you, I will take the ring into Mordor. Okay. Mordor? Because I found the other images too. There's nothing else on there. Oh, that's supposed to like tell me to add more. <laughs> Swear. Okay. Mordor. I don't even want to take notes this one. The black gate is too... Sam, we can't go this way. The black gate is too mainstream. I don't know what the fuck that means. I don't know who the fuck Sam is. Alright, we got something in here though. <laughs> I don't know who these people are. <laughs> yeah, but there's nothing really in there. It's just I will do it. That's all. Um, so we got... Okay. So we'll just say... Um, HTTP CTF dumbassery. We'll call it that. Um, from the following, we are supposed to know to do a slash Mordor. <laughs> okay. So let's go into slash Mordor. Then we get this. Then source code actually gives us something with that one. So we actually get something with that. So let's go ahead and do this like right here. I don't know what that is yet, but we got something now. Let's go ahead and uh, see if this is anything. If it's Cyber Chef or anything like that. We'll try to see what the hell this is. All right, I'll put something closer. What? What? Is that equals closer? I feel like that's something too then. Oh, okay. Alright. So we found this like right here. Base 64. Then grab the stuff that is not base 64. And base 64 again. We get that. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab this guy like right here. And we'll throw him up here. Um, like that, I would take it. Without the Mordor. Welcome to the gates of Mordor. Let's go! <laughs> We're somewhere. Alright. I know none of those characters that we all just looked at. I don't know a single one of them. So let me get that guy, Sam. One of them's name is Sam. My son's name is Sam. So that's helpful. Oh no, you can backseat this whole one because I have no idea what the hell is going on here. Um, I'm just going to SQL map the shit out of this thing. Or we'll just try this at first. Okay, yeah, we're just going to SQL map the crap out of this thing. So let's go ahead and do a SQL map for forms maybe. Probably start just doing batch, huh? Sam and Frodo? Is that who Frodo is? I've heard of Frodo. Let me see this ugly motherfucker. Oh, damn it. I got too excited when I heard about Frodo. Oh, he's in the hipster image. So, which one's Frodo? That looks like a Frodo to me. On the left, this one's Frodo? Oh, shit. I thought the other one's Frodo. Frodo. 
There's some ugly ass motherfuckers like right there. All right, so password appears to be MySQL. So it appears to be injectable so far. We'll let that run. Well, that's running. Since I know who Frodo is now, I'm going to grab some popcorn. Um, do you want to exploit this? No, I don't. Yes, I want to exploit it. Come on now. That was a stupid-ass question. All right. I'm going to grab, um, let's throw some popcorn in the uh, microwave, like, real quick. Hey, thank you for the follow! from the kitchen for the follow. Let me see here. That's because he just found out who Frodo is also. The infamous. Thank you very much for following. Infamous. He just found out who Frodo was too. He's like, fuck yeah. I'm following this channel. I'm figuring shit out. Um, we should probably also, instead of just throwing this SQL map at it immediately, we should probably actually do stuff too. Okay, so it's getting, oh, that's going to take a minute, huh? Let's go ahead and do a go buster on that also. Um, to see if like there's like any like type of like bypass or anything like that for wherever the hell we just were and I don't remember. Crap. Okay, right there. Let's go ahead and do a go buster on him also. Although I think if we do a go buster on him, I think he's probably gonna break. Just throwing it out there. Pretty much said no. All right, so that's from that's from Lord of the Rings, right? Right? Fucking crushing this shit. You know what the worst part is? My wife, she uh, she's really into those movies and stuff like that, and I, I didn't even know who Frodo was till ten minutes ago, and uh, yeah, she gets super mad at me about it all the time. All the time, gets super mad at me about it. Um, okay, so we found, so we did an SQL map on him, right? And we're finding stuff. So it's definitely doing stuff. There's a TV series. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I know that, um, fucking bounty hunter Star Wars dude. God, what's his name? I know him. Don't tell me his name. Um, oh, where's the helmet? He's the bounty hunter. He's in Star Wars. Oh God, my wife's favorite character too. He has a whole the Mandalorian. It's not. He's not a Mandalorian because he's not a real Mandalorian ever. Cause he takes his helmet off or whatever. Um, what's that dude's name? Oh God. It's also it's also one a.m. here too. So you know I'm tired. I'm gonna blame it on that. All right. So we have web app. Um, he's in Star Wars. I forget what the hell the guy's name is. Well, I know who he is. <laughs> I know it doesn't sound like I know who he is, but. Boba Fett. Thank you. No, nothing. Thank you. Yes, Boba Fett. That's like my wife's like favorite character. Grisha, she's not here. Or else... You guys would have saw a murder and divorce on stream all at the same time. I probably would have I probably would have been murdered. But yeah, Boba Fett, I know who he is. And Yeah. There's no tables? Just tac tac dump then? How are there no tables in web app? Web app appears to be empty? No. We do level five risk equals three. 
Bullshit, Dempsey. No way. What other tables were there? Yes, I do know Boba Fett, though. I know him. I know that he was a bounty hunter. I know that he's not an actual Mandalorian. Probably because it's uh, probably case sensitive, isn't it? Yeah, he's not a real Mandalorian because he takes his helmet off or whatever, right? Um, He got eaten by that one big-ass thing. That big-ass worm. But he was like, nah, fuck no, mate. And he like blasts his way out of it. And I guess if you watch the movies, he's dead. But if you read the books, he's actually alive. Yeah. I know all this stuff. Yep. Oh, yeah. All right, so let's do tech 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 t users tech tech dump. Yeah, I noticed. It's case sensitive. I, I don't know why I wasn't thinking that. Is that not like uppercase user or some of that? Is users? Did I mess that up too? I did, 100%. Is it usually case sensitive? I feel like it's not usually, well, maybe it's just not usually uppercase. Never mind. It's very important to not stress the network. I was trying to do a damn go buster while this was going. It's very important to not stress the network. Yep, here we go. Hold my beer and watch this, you know? I'm asking good popcorn. You know what the worst, you know what the only bad thing is? Is that I gotta go grocery shopping. I don't like going grocery shopping. I don't really like people that much. I don't like interacting with people. I don't like uh, when people can actually see me and stuff. I don't like that. I don't like uh, like when they can touch me. I don't like, I don't like the, you know, I'm from New York. Like I already, I've gotten touched enough. Like I don't want to be touched anymore. You know? And now I gotta go grocery shopping. But now, um, if you've ever been to a foreign country, if you're from America, you may not realize this, and if you stay there your whole life or whatever. Um, but in like the Asia countries, right? Um, like personal space, that's not a thing. That's not real. Yeah. I, 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 I can't really do grocery shopping online though. Because I got to go to like the banana store and you have to bring yen and you just got to talk to the old... Asian lady, and you're like, hey, I need fruit. And she's like, Kanishiwa, height, I got you. And you're like, fuck yeah, mate. And then she goes to get you fruit. She comes back, she weighs it. She's like, this much. You're like, and then you look at it like, ah. She's like, okay, this much. She's like, okay. And then you give her that much. And that's the banana store. And that's like where you buy the fruit. But commissary, I'll go there to buy everything else. But yeah, banana store, I got to go there to buy fruit. Because it's way too expensive at the commissary. Because they import it from America. So it's way too expensive. Yeah, you always need to get like lower prices if you walk up there like, yo, Kanishiwa. They're like, oh, height. You're like, height. Uh, pankiki. That's pancakes, just so you guys know. In Japanese, there you go. You guys are learning something. Kanishiwa is like good afternoon, but it's also like a, kind of like a green thing too. Like, Hi, you know, after, uh, after morning, because Ohio Gozamas, that's, uh, good, well, Ohio's good morning, Ohio Gozamas is like the, you know, the person's older than you, polite way of saying it, Kanishiwa Gozamas, but yeah, there you go. Yeah, Pankiki. My wife named her car Pankiki. It's great. My precious, oh, isn't that that little annoying thing? This is why I didn't watch that movie. There was that little annoying, like, freaking hobbit-looking thing. 
and it started talking. I remember it was like, ah, and I was like, yo, like I can't watch. Like it annoyed me so much. I turned the movie off because everybody was like, you know, talking about freaking Lord of the Rings. I was like, all right, well, you know, I'll give it a try. I'll give it a watch, right? I turned it on. That little thing started talking. Fucking elf hobbit thing. And it, the, his voice like triggered me. And I shut it off. So I got into like, it was like 10 minutes of it. And that thing came out and started. Golum? That's his name? Whoever played his voice needs to fix themselves. Smeagol? Ah, oh, that, that guy like right there? Yeah, me and him, we got problems. I will take the ring, my precious root, and my sword. Oh crap, keeps going. Wait a minute, are we getting logins like right now? Like a Smeagol's login, my precious root, Frodo's logins, I will take the ring. Are these just plain text? Logins like right now? Is that what's happening here? Smeagol's a punk ass, isn't he? Double personality he is. It's like, it's like some Yoda thing. <laughs> Christy, that sounds like Yoda or something. Like, double personality he is. Like, oh. Alright, these are logins. Uh, let's start SSH. Let's start SSH because he's a punk ass, Smeagol, right? So Smeagol... And I've heard of him the most. I know him. My precious root. Alright, let's go! So Smeagol got in. That fucking pogue. Alright, let's grab this stuff. Right here. And we'll throw Smeagol. Um, started dumping database. And found this thing there. Alright, so we logged in with Smeagol, right? Okay, so we're in there with Smeagol now. I'll do a uh, sudo tech else. We know his password. Let's go ahead and do a. Okay, let's go ahead and do a cat user pass.txt or nano user pass.txt, excuse me. And we'll go ahead and we'll just do Frodo. I'll take the ring. Okay. Um, Smeagol. My precious root. And it's got two zeros in it too. You know he's a he's a nerd. Aragon. Aragorn. Arag you guys know. I don't know. And my sword. He must carry a sword. Legolas. Does he carry a bow? I'm fucking crushing this shit. You guys see me do the uh, anime ones. This is uh, Lord of Root. Binary Soldier. Um, if you like Lord of the Rings, just don't mind me. Because I have no idea what any of this stuff is. But you guys see me do the anime ones. The anime ones, my wife actually helped me with one one time. Because I didn't know who any of the characters were. And like I was supposed to know who they were to like, do this one. I was like, I don't know who the fuck these people are. All right, let's go ahead and cat user pass dot text. Um, sudo tech L. Okay, and he is my precious root. Okay, he can't run that. Cat scripts as you already look up. Let's go and see what's going on here. Secret door two file, one file, three file. Okay, so we can get to a whole bunch of secret doors. Let's go ahead and see what that's all about. CD and slash secret. CD in door one. Or is this the port knocking? Okay. 
Okay, let's go ahead and show that we did the SUID bits. Carrot, 16 hours, you ate only... No, 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 no. Nope, I had um, three slices of pizza also. I had three slices of pizza, and now I'm having some popcorn. And I might even have a hot dog tonight. I mean, it's 1.18 in the morning, but I might have a hot dog. Might. We'll find out. Depends if I feel risky or not. We also got this user bin X. I wonder if that's supposed to throw you off this user bin X like right there. Because I don't know what the heck that is also. So we got quite a few things in here that it looks like we can do. I wonder if this is supposed to send you down a rabbit hole and X is actually supposed to be the thing. All right, if you spend more than an hour or so, hour or two, you know, trying to do the same exact thing and you don't know if it's right or not, um, move on next thing. Okay. Oh, no, no. I, I, I've eaten a lot less than this. When I was, uh, here, side quest. Did I even start up the freaking... Okay, good. At least start recording this time. So I was in Afghanistan, right? We had Sesquan chicken, right? No, I have not yet binary. Uh, but yeah, we had Sesquan chicken, right? So Sesquan chicken, now first off, it comes with a UGRE. I'm sure you guys have heard of MRE. So like the meal's ready to eat, you know? They always have like civilians trial them and they're like, oh, this is disgusting. Or some people are like, oh, this is great. Then they don't shit for a week. And then they're like, what's wrong with me? Yeah, that's an MRE, right? A UGRE is a platoon-sized MRE. So it's just a humongous MRE. It's got a whole bunch of heaters. You pour water in there, starts up, and you got a guy that wakes up in the morning, pours water in there, and that's it, right? Everyone just kind of serves himself. Um, there's flies everywhere, so you just kind of freaking smack the flies off, get your UGRE, right? We had Sesquan chicken, okay? Dude, Sesquan chicken was not good the first night I had it, all right? It was like three and a half, four months later, we still only had Sesquan chicken. That was the only UGRE we had in this fucking quad con. So the only thing we could eat was Sesquan chicken. Then it became we ran out of eggs, like the eggs, and they weren't good anyways. They're just, just watered down, horrible eggs, right? And then it's <laughs> so for breakfast and dinner, we're just eating Sesquan chicken every day. It was the most disgusting. Worst thing I've ever had in my entire life. God. Like that. And um, there's a type of muffin. I guarantee you all have had them too. Otis Spunkmeyer muffins. And everyone that I talked to, oh, I love those. For six months, that's really all we ate because we all we had other than that was Sesquad chicken. I look at those things and I almost throw up. But yeah, it was that was probably one of the funniest things was that damn Sesquan chicken. It was like, yo, you gotta be kidding me. It's every day you woke up and you could smell it, the Sesquan chicken. It was horrible. Yeah, it sounds real professional, doesn't it? Binary? It sounds like, ooh man, you know, you gotta order some Sesquan chicken at the at the uh, you know, the nice restaurant or whatever. No. No, it's not nice. It's it's miserable. Uh let's go ahead and locate Limpies. So we'll copy this over. Yeah, we were going out. We were going out in the market and some of that, and the bazaar and everything. And we would uh, like buy stuff from out there. But so if you like bought a chicken, right, you would have to pick it up the next day because they would have to pray whenever they killed it, right? So I think it was sundown. They would pray, they kill it, they prep it, and then it'll be ready the next day for you, right? <laughs> so they they'd have it the next day for you. So we were going out there. And we were buying everything that we possibly could from out 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 in town and then we come back and the afghani army they're like lowest rank dude like their pfc was literally only there to clean and cook and that was it so we go and we give it to that dude and he would cook it and everything but um how they cooked and stuff like that it's a whole nother story for a whole nother time stuff like that especially since a lot of you i just met <laughs> but yeah they didn't really cook in the most sanitary ways you know they don't have like a stove a stove they don't, they can't just power on the oven and start cooking it, you know, but, um, yeah, shit's really good coals. Shit makes really good coals. But, um, yeah, so they would, we, we would get it from them after that and we just sit there and just eat and you didn't really have silverware. So you would have like a fork that maybe, or a spoon that you carried around or whatever, like a plastic spoon or just your hands. You just sit there and just eat it up. And that was it. It was good. It was a good time. You know, it was good times. Let's go into a Python three HP server, right? And we'll throw, uh. 
this guy over in here, WCD uh, and attempt, because we have so many SUID bits there. I want to see what we can actually mess with, what we can actually be, you know, what's going on with everything. So we're going to W get HP 10, 10, 0, 4, slash limpies dot sh and we'll go ahead and do a change mode plus x for limpies dot sh we'll go ahead and run that and we'll see what can we actually mess with it um there you go legs version's up wrong but let's go ahead and actually make sure that there's nothing else on here because this box could just be really old so he may have not that may not be the way that he wants us to go up so Best storyteller on Twitch award to carry. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and my wife actually, she actually got some Otis Spunkmeyer muffins one time. Totally forgot, like, how I felt about them, you know, and everything. And, like, I saw them, and she could tell I was just, like, disgusted by them, right? I was like, oh, God. Like, I, I felt, like, sick to my stomach. And she immediately was like, oh, my God, I totally forgot about it. I'm so sorry. I'm like, no, it's okay. Like, it's not your fault that, you know, what happened. All right, so it looks like, so it does say that these file is a way up. How it's a way up, we don't know yet, but it's definitely a way up. So I'm going to leave the, um, the kernel out of it for now. And yes, it is 1.30 in the morning. I'm going to leave the kernel out of it. You know what I'm saying? Like that is... So if you're doing the kernel, you're an asshole. <laughs> because it's 1.30 in the morning here. I mean, that's obviously a way up. You know, that's that's not a difficult way though because there's other ways up into this guy. That's not the intended path. The box is probably just older. The guy's not... I mean, it's on Vault Hub. It's already uploaded and everything like that. Then the guy's not going to go in there and, you know, freaking update it every single time or something like that. And then try to re-upload it. So, we have file. All right. Now, if it is a Linux buffer overflow, then yeah, I'm 100 seconds to do the kernel. <laughs> so, we have file, right? We can mess with those. Now, we just have to figure out how to mess with those or what can we do to mess with those, right? All right, um, let's go to strings that file again. Strings, uh, was it secret, right? Where was that at again? Because that's 100% a path up. And that says that I need to input something. We just don't know what we need to input yet. All three of them are. DZ, is it a buffer overflow? Okay, well, I'm not doing buffer overflow, DZ. I'm not doing it like right now. I'm not doing a Linux buffer overflow right now. If it was a Windows one, I would. Does it matter what file we use for the buffer overflow? I feel like it doesn't. Let's see why it's a buffer overflow first off. Is it the printf function? Oh, string copy function? Okay. Yep. Okay. All right. Here we go. I pull the sleeves up. I am not good at links buffer overflows. I'm telling you that right now. But I'm going to pull out some old notes and we're going to try something, okay? Yes, we actually had a whole month of buffer overflows. But you know what? They're on Windows. Where is... Is it in here? Nope. 
Hey, thanks a lot for the follow, Troy. Troy Links. Now we kind of have to do this, huh? Okay, I know that I have... Now, I can't give away. The problem is I can't obviously give test away here. So let me go ahead and see the you know, exploit development. I have exploit and Linux like right there. That's probably it. Okay. There shouldn't be any test things in here. Everyone close your eyes. No. Okay, no, there's not any testings in here. Okay. I'm going to go with this most likely just going to be um, the uptime. Like right now, we start at 9 a.m. So, 9 a.m. my time. Let me see. Okay, we have, I'm going to stop and I'm going to stop at seven and a half hours. So, 24 minus seven and a half hours. I don't know how to do the uptime thing on, uh, on it there. So, we have the binary, right? We have fine. Let's go ahead and do an L trace for file. Okay. String copy. Okay, cool. Do check this cool tool for note taking. It's called oh, Obsidian. Yeah. No, I know what Obsidian is. I'm just stuck in my ways. So let's go ahead and do a GDB tech queue. file all right sweet we still need to fuzz these guys to like where we could actually overtake it at and everything okay break so it's actually the same as i think isn't it str copy is it in here actually where string copy yeah str copy I'm not seeing it in here anywhere though I'm gonna try it Okay, so we got our breakpoint. So it's obviously in there somewhere because we got our breakpoint now. All right. Okay. So exit it normally. Assemble main, good point. Okay, there we go, right there. So, it's toward the end. That's probably why it's exiting normally, huh? So we're not really doing anything crazy here in Ari. Okay, if you're one process... Exit normally, okay. So now we want to get to the ESP, right? Exit before that, huh? 
Um. No registers. Huh. Yeah, because the exit is before that, so that's why I think it's exiting. Because we got exit, like, right here. String copies down here. We're not getting anything for ESP because it's exiting, huh? Okay. We're not getting any registers for the ESP. We found it, like where the street copy is. So let's go ahead and take where's there it is. I think we want that one like right there, right? I think we want him. Because we actually see, pretty sure we see it right here for him. And I'm pretty sure we want to actually do a X20i. Probably, brought, I probably should have brought this back to myself, huh? Call that guy. Okay, there's ASLR. Here, I got an idea. That's my idea. It's one thirty seven in the morning.
not dealing with ASLR like right now. That one, like right there. Let's go ahead and uh, I'll actually look it up. The search point, search point, three point nineteen point zero, attack twenty five. Way too much, wasn't it? Um, you know what we can look at? Let's go ahead and um, actually up here. Let's go ahead and copy locate les.sh links exploit suggestion, right? We'll copy that over to here. Let's go ahead and do a HTTP server. We're going to do a wget HTTP 10 10 0 4 slash les dot sh. Okay, sounds good. Hey, these are all for following how Earth cat. Oh, shit. Binary Soldier, thanks for following. Uh, let's go ahead and do, yep, so we got that guy over here. Change mode, plus X for les.sh, period slash les.sh. Let's see what we got here. 30 cow, dirty cow. There, same edit. Probable. Much probables here, huh? Huh. Highly probable for dirty cow. Obviously, so I mean, I'm not really too surprised about that like right there, but I feel like I feel like everyone always uses dirty cow And if dirty cow doesn't work sometimes you can really jack the box up no, That's all good What is USB MIDI? That sounds like fun, doesn't it? What are this? Oh, it's dots. It's text. Never mind. What is that? Okay, just gives me the URL for it. That's boring. I don't really use that one ever. Oh, fuck it. Dirty cow. <laughs> I thought dirty cow was in here. One dirty cow. It breaks the box. Oh well. Um. Usually I do the cow text C one. Usually I do this one like right here. That's one that I usually seem to like. We go with dead beef. Just because it's called dead beef. That's kind of funny, right? Go to a W get. And uh, we'll bring this back down to us. OK, 
Okay, we got count C. It's going cat count C. Make sure we don't see how to compile them or whatever else, you know, we got to do. Um, so let's make sure that we got GCC in here first. Yes, we do. So let's go ahead and throw this guy over there. And we'll do that. And I believe it's just called Kyle C, right? Is that what I grabbed, like, right there? Yeah. Let's go ahead and do a wget HTTP 10 Okay. And let's go ahead and compile him now. Okay, just a warning, don't care. Now let's see what happens. Will he break? I mean, I'll take it next year or some of like that. I don't know. I'm saying binaries, whenever, you know. Not in a rush. Oh. <laughs> will he break? Yes, he will. All right, at least it's, it's still up. So let's try that one more time. Uh oh. <laughs> Think we broke them. Oh, yeah, he's frozen. All right, well, let's power him off. We'll start him back up again. And, um, I'll uh, probably try to pick another one. See what happens. But we'll start him back up again. We'll see what happens. Dead, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's dead. It was so dead that we're actually using dead beef this time. Let's try one more time. Let's go ahead and grab a uh, dead beef. What we got going on over here? How do we compile this guy? Or is he not going to tell us how to compile him? He doesn't tell us how to. Well, I'm sure it's the same way that we compiled the other one, right? Yeah, he actually doesn't tell us how to compile him. That's kind of a... That's something. Here. Uh, I don't I don't I'm never really on hack the box never I'm not on there very much how about that um, let's go ahead and grab this guy W get him and we'll go ahead and we'll do a first off we'll see if um, we can even get back in huh I'm going to try SSH and a Smeagol there. Okay, we can. But cat user pass dot text. That's why I take notes. My precious root. CD slash temp. Okay. And let's go ahead and uh 
get this one over there. Dead beef. Let's see what happens. Uh, w get HTTP. 10, 10, 0, 4. Slash that one like right there. Uh, let's do a GCC. Uh, I'm going to go like tax C again. Kind of like the same thing, right? So we'll do a tax G tax C. What do you guys think? How should we compile this guy? Because he doesn't actually say how to compile him. Go up to the top here. He doesn't ever actually say how to compile him. So I have no idea how to compile this guy. Or what he wants, you know what I'm saying, or anything like that. I also have no idea what this guy even does. Try one more time. Hey, thank you much for the follow autograph twenty twenty. Okay. Try it one more time. See what happens. We broke him again. Yeah, he's broke. All right, we won't try that one again. We'll try something else here. Try something a little bit different this time. Um, I don't even know which one. We had that les.sh ran, right? You can try to look at that like real quick. Exploit, right? Local privilege escalation. There we go. <clears throat> um, no, fourteen point zero four. We probably want this one right here, huh? Let's go and do a search exploit. Attack M for that one. Go ahead and start this guy back up again. Oh, he's already started. Okay, we should be able to log into him now. I don't remember what the hell his password was. Smeagol, my precious root. We'll try one more time. Like the comment said, what is? Did you uncomment the code that's? Oh no, probably not. No, I always figure out that because usually I, <clears throat> I have one sitting on here <coughs> that I usually use. So I have to get rid of the X64 code, huh? I forgot about that.
10, 10, 0, 4. We're going to try this guy right here. Just have fun with it. Still going to make it hard. Okay. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Thank you. <clears throat> this was not seeing how to compile them either. This is, I don't really see that many that don't see how to how to compile not. They usually see how to compile them. Or what they want done to compile them. I think that's kinda of weird that they've uh, been doing that one lately. There. That's how you do it, like, right there. Yeah, that's what I just did. That's how you compile something, like, right there. <laughs> Root, LSTACLA, cat, flag, dot, sex. Alright, that's good enough for me. Oh, crap. Alright, there's that guy. He's finished. Oh, man. I don't have any good stories like right now. Nothing reminded me of anything. When does stream, or when does Twitch make you stop streaming? Isn't it like 30 something hours? Um. I don't know. Let's see here. Shut him off. <clears throat> 